Just a minute, Mike. Come in. I got a call from John Tower. He wants to talk to you. It's all right, Mike. Go on. They're beginning to talk about impeachment. They can't impeach him. They won't have the votes for it in the Senate. I know. But the evidence is overwhelming. We all think the president should hire a criminal defense attorney. He's not a criminal. Why do I need an attorney? You don't need an attorney, Mr. President. You want to have one. That's all. I have one to talk to. Ronnie, we've got to have somebody. We haven't done anything illegal. No one's saying you've done anything illegal. It's just that there are so many questions. Well, tell them to ask that bastard, that, that lying son of a gun, Oliver North. Ask him who gave the money to the Contras. They will, Mr. President. Ronnie, you have to talk to them. I could set up a press conference. No, no press conference. How's he going to talk to them? Television. He can talk to the people on television. They got Nixon. And now they think they're going to get me. Well, I'm not Nixon. Everybody knows that. But you have to talk to them. You have to talk to the people. You have to make them believe you. OK, OK. Calm down. Now, don't worry. Don't cry. I can handle this I now. Don't... don't cry, darling. She cries more than any woman I know. She <laughs> cries. She cries when we send out the laundry. Uh -huh. Just make sure he gets an attorney. You're the only one we can trust, you know. Don't worry. It's gonna be okay. It is. All I wanted was to save those people. That's all I wanted. Ronnie, what have you done to yourself? Well, uh, don't ask. Charity baseball game. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for coming down. I, I, I hope I'm not taking you away from anything. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm not working. I mean, well, I've got the day off. <laughs> All right, listen. Uh, this is the thing. I've got this actress. Over there, see her? Yeah. Her name's Nancy Davis. Just came out from Chicago. Extremely conservative, extremely Republican, if you know what I mean. Last week, the Hollywood Reporter came out with a list of communist sympathizers, and her name was on it. Of course, she's upset, scared about her career, her apartment, her friends. She asked me for advice. I told her I knew you, and since you're president of the Screen Actors Guild, maybe you could help. So she's not a communist sympathizer? No, no, no. No way. She comes from a Republican family. Anyway, I uh, think you can look into it. Sure, I'll see what I can find out. Oh, good, good. Uh, do me one more favor. Ask her out for dinner or something. Make her happy. I need her to be happy. Dinner? Uh, nothing expensive, just something nice. I'm telling you, she's a wreck. Mission accomplished. Marvin, you're a peach. 